Are we considered chattel and being controlled by the government? And if so, how do we become free? Is the Messiah alive today and are we living out the book of Revelation? Well, all these questions and more are going to be answered in this multi-part series as I stumbled upon some information that was from an interview in 2008 with an alleged ruling bloodline priest. Now, if you missed part one to this series, just go into my video list and at the top there is a playlist, Interview with a Bloodline Priest, and this is where you will find all the videos in this series. By the way, this is just for informational purposes. None of this is to be taken as fact, so let's get into it. He asks, are we considered chattel and traded as such by the government? He says, by the governments generally, yes. People are seen as collateral pawns that are maneuvered around on the chessboard according to the game plan. By the family, contrary to popular beliefs, many of us do not mean you any harm directly. There is just a matter of divine destiny to uphold and unfold, and we must play our parts in the game as given to us by the creator. In many ways, it is actually in our own interest that you are prepared for the coming harvest, which we'll get into. Just maybe not prepared in quite the way that you would like. Still, even then, you are choosing the negative polarity with your own free will decisions. With a little help and direction, from us. Souls are harvestable in either extreme of the polarities one could say. Okay, so the interviewer asks, if so, how do we become freemen? He says, you will never be free for as long as you are incarnating on this planet. The very nature of your being here is indication of that. There is a reason why you are here, and here is very likely not really where you think here is. How do you become free? By working out where you are and coming to an understanding of why you are here. You are fast running out of time to do so before the coming harvest. Those that don't make it will have to repeat the cycle.